Here we go. Man, thanks thanks again, guys, for joining me. We are live. I believe I think we're live. Are we live? I don't we're know. Live. Anyway, we're good. Hell yeah, it does. You know it. Oh, wait a minute. That didn't. You know this. Wait a minute. Hide it. How do I make this thing work? There we go. Hello. Thank you for joining me. If you're joining me, if anybody's joining me, thanks for joining me. If you're catching this on the rewind, thanks for watching, man. How you doing? That we're gonna get to that later, Patrick. We're gonna get to your poll later. As a matter of fact, I'll make a banner for your poll. We're definitely gonna get to that when we get to some chatting. But right now, I want to welcome anybody joining us live and anybody catching this on the replay to another edition of the Comic Book Pop Up Show. Presented by Discovery Bay Comics, I'm JB, and I've got co-host today, Big Will, and Sir. Patrick from Big Lion Cat 646. Thank you guys for joining me, and they're going to help me sort out what this is. Well, what is this, you ask? This is the Buy It Now opportunity. I actually have branding. Where's the branding? This is a Buy It Now opportunity where I'm going to show, I'm going to offer 10 rounds of books in a 12-up grid with the first three rounds being $1 books. Rounds four through seven are going to be $3 books. Rounds eight and nine today are going to be $5 books. And round 10 is $20 books. And those are going to be made available to the live chat via what I like to call the Thorough Q Burrow. Not sorry. I always mess that up. The Keep It Thorough style starting line. So anybody who's participating in the live chat has the first opportunity at doing a buy it now on any of these books by placing the letter that they want during the round after I've placed starting line in the live chat. So I have some help help here today. Thanks for joining me, gentlemen. What do you guys got going on today right before the holidays? Anything cool? Well, I just finished uh, work, got home uh, barely because dealing with the traffic and um, we're going to have a great time and uh, let's get rolling. Well, let's get the poll out there while I set up the board. Go ahead. You've got a question that has been beating us up here in the pre-show. What What is that question that you've got going on? Oh, me? Yeah. Why is it the, the, the Cheeto one? Yeah, the yeah. Cheeto one. I mean, that's the hot question of the day right now. All right. I want the people out in the chat to vote. Do you like puff or do you like crunchy? Right? We're split right now. We are absolutely split. So we're going to let the chat decide where we puff think that goes. Right now, because YouTube, YouTube voted crunchy. YouTube voted crunchy? What do you mean? Yeah, is both our, you is guys, both you guys oh, voted. yeah, yes, definitely. We voted crunchy. So come if on. I had a choice. If I had Puff. a choice, that is. Come on, Puffs. Vote for Puffs. Come on, man. <laughs> First of all, do we have anybody actually joining us in the live chat? Yeah, we got Hawaiian Punch 72. Where is oh, he? Right right there. There. Again, no 72. Way. How's it going? Thank you for stopping in. Up the down seven, who I do believe is working on. Yes, he is. He's still working on some free shipping that he won the other day. Congratulations. Okay. And by the way, up the down oh, is now right. voting. Crunchy. Crunchy. Okay, Conquistador says, keep Crunchy. them both. Give me some cheese balls. Cheese balls. Thanks no. for joining me, Javi. Uh, that was so much fun last night. Oh, by the way, if you didn't catch the rewind on last night's episode of Inquiring Minds on Hialeah Comic Bros channel, it was fantastic. They had a really cool guest. Me and uh, Javi and Hialeah kind of just, it's just a good time. It's its its getting to know your YouTube community because we were sharing back and forth. If you don't get a chance to watch it, go ahead and check it out. Okay, comics on the mind. What do you mean, wrong channel? I shouted you out, man. Just the other day, I was giving you all oh, kinds guys. of love on your second video, talking about oh, how you oh, how you oh, reviewed oh, your Avengers. Loving oh, your work, oh, man. As a matter of fact, oh, not hold on. Uh, Comics on the Mind is going to be the special guest for tonight's comic book book club because it's Wednesday night. You know what that means. And I think it's on John's Comics with Kids tonight. You got Comic Book Day book club, and I went out and bought the book today for that because I'm going to be ready for that one. But Comics on the Mind is going to be the special guest. Let me set up this board. Stop yapping. Uh, so who I, 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 I hate to tell you this, but it's looking like Crunchy is winning in the chat. Ooh, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. It ain't over yet. Come on. Pop. It ain't over. It ain't over. Roll That's what he pop. says. It ain't pop. over. Okay. I've got the board set up for round one. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Uh, Matt, thanks for stopping in. Conquistadors. Oh, wait a minute. I know how to say this. Jaguar Chikata is in the house. Thank you for stopping by. Man, I appreciate you there. Okay. So let's get started by me changing the camera here to. The, uh, you know what? I didn't set that one up. Sons of Wika Lika. Okay, let's see what we got here. Let's see if it works. I'll go me. Bam. Ooh, it looks like it's still set up. 
I'm going to go ahead and drop the branding over the top of this for my $1 auction. Come back to the comments and let's go ahead and get a starting line on round one. So let me uh, explain once again what we've got here. We're going to do a buy it now. And oh, that old comic smell. Please tell me you got my message. You're all paid up. I've got a beautiful package ready to go your way, but I cannot find your address and any of our correspondence. So please, that old comic smell, uh, go ahead and reply to my last email and hit me up with your address so I can get your books out because you're all paid up and I want to get those out. Okay, so what we've got here is buy it now opportunities based on the letter. I'm going to drop a starting line in the chat and anybody watching live can claim these books. But guess what? You don't have to be here live. If you're watching this on the Rewind, you can still participate by dropping a comment below or hitting me up on Instagram with the letter and the round that you're interested. I'll go ahead and start a pile for you if you haven't gotten one. Shipping rates are displayed, and we're going to get started with round one here and a starting line. How's our music today? My beats to chill to. Good, good, good. All right. You got two gum Pedros in the chat. Two gun Pedro, how you doing? He's got a little pile gun studios also in there. 36 Chambers Studios. Okay, we got the starting line. This is what it looks like, folks. When I drop this in the chat, these books are open and available to be claimed by anybody currently watching in the live chat. I didn't actually go over them. If we do want to go over them, I've got Hercules number one and two from a limited series here in the a and E position. Hey, JB, yeah. no, one letter at a time. One letter at a time. Oh, one letter at a time. Yep. We've got uh, Hercules number two in the A. We've got Doctor Strange number 10 in the B. We've got a G.I. Joe Wanted number one in the C position. We've got a Sensational Spider-Man number five in the D. Remember, all these are $1. We've got a Hercules number one in the E position. Fantastic Four issue number three in the F. Deathlock, issue number two, in the G position, Night Moves, issue number two from IDW, $1 in the H. Over here in the I position, we've got Invaders, number one, and that won't be the first time you, or the last time you see that book, I'll tell you what. Next, next to it, we've got a Namor, number one, $1. Next to that, we've got Death of the Inhumans. Number two, and next to that, Defenders, the best defense, number one, number one. All these books are available for $1. If you are interested and you're watching us live, go ahead and pop that letter in the comments, and I'll go ahead and pull that aside for you. Yeah, if you're yeah. watching this on the Rewind, please reference round one and the letter. There you go. It comes a lot. It's got K for Zach B. Okay, let me get my post-its going. Zach B also has got a pile going. Let me get your $1 claim in there. Zach B says, I, got Zach I will first. take letter K. Zach was first on my board. Sorry, yeah. comics for all people. I did see him first. He says, I will take letter K for $1. And letter K is... Take letter L. He's, and letter L. K and L for Zach B. Those are both of yours. Let me pull those aside for you without pulling a Kenny and knocking everything else down. And we've got those set aside. Wonderful. Thank you very much. That old comic smell. I have got your address, and those will be going out maybe this afternoon. Come on, guys. Dollar books. Just put the letter in. Zach B is the first claimer. He has taken letter K and letter L. I'm sorry, comics for all people. That's just how it showed up on my uh, screen. Yep, hey, Cheeto Comics and more. My local LCS is in the house. Thank you very much. As a matter of fact, I wonder if I got time real quick. Let's see if this would work. Let's see if this works. You know, this StreamYard thing is so fun. I'm having a lot of fun with StreamYard right now, learning how to, to navigate the graphics and things. And as long as you, you stay within the guidelines, this was my haul today from Chino Comics and more. Oh, let me see. What They're my doing? LCS out there in Houston, Texas. Those guys are taking good care of me. These books will be shipping my way. Uh, as soon as I say go, I like to maybe get a couple weeks together to... Help oh, out wow. the shipping costs, but those are the that was my picks this week. So those hey, are head my way. Back. Compliments to Chino. Nice. Appreciate you, fellas. Thanks like for shouting me out today. So we're gonna go ahead and close round one. It looks like there's no more claims on round one, and go ahead and move on to round two. So round one is now closed. <clears throat> Again, if you're watching this on the rewind, just reference the round and reference the letter. I keep them in order, which I took the grid off. I should put the grid back on. Put the grid back on. 
I keep them in order when I put them away. So you'll just reference that letter and it's easy for me to pull. JB, was that 266 a actual 266 or facsimile in your hall? Hold on, let's see. Look like a real one, no? Uh, is is it? Am I swiping it up right now, or what, what are we talking about? I'm asking about your hall, the X Men 266. Was that a facsimile or a real one? That's the facsimile. That's the facsimile. Yes. Ah, uh, boo! I thought it was a real one. Uh, you, uh, yeah, uh, R and R does all the new all the new comic book day comics for me. Okay, so let's get to round two of the dollar books, and we're going to start with. Let me go ahead and switch the cameras back. We're going to start with America versus the Justice Society, issue number two, one dollar. We've got an Aquaman issue number nineteen. I think there's some key factor. Don't know what it is. One dollar. The Flash year one number seventy three. One dollar. Comic Jabroni joined us in the chat. The Green Lantern. Welcome. New Guardians number five, one dollar. Is the did you say Edwin the comic Jabroni? Edwin, how you doing, Edwin? Thanks for joining me live. Appreciate you. Also, I'm keeping up my work. I'm six pounds down since I started working out. Thanks to you, brother. Oh yeah. <laughs> Next up here, a uh, Fantastic Four issue number four with a guest appearance from the Silver Surfer. Aquaman issue number 31, one dollar. America versus the Justice Society number four. What issue was the first one that could have scored? Oh, that one number four. Oh, that was number two. Sorry, there you go. You got number two and number four on the board for one dollar. The Uncanny Avengers issue 30. Hacks slash versus chaos number one. And Hawkeye number two. All right, this is round two, folks, for one dollar. I'm going to go ahead and post that starting line in there and see if anybody watching in the live chat, which, by the way, I've got 23 people joining me in the live chat. Thank you very much for stopping by. I appreciate that. That is correct, Javi. Six pounds down. Oh, Comic Head 84. Oh, to Comic Head. He's down, but not out. He's down, not out. So round two is now open for any claims. Just go ahead and pop the letter in the chat. One letter at a time, guys, to vote. When yeah. we're, I'm trying to, we're trying to keep it, uh, you know, kind of even here. Right. Now, these books can all still be available. Any unsold books will be available via claim. Well, you can uh, get time, Jaguar. Jaguar's new. He's cool. He's going to come back with the J. It's all right. No one's going to yeah. beat him to it. You take the so eight. if you're watching this on the Rewind, feel free to reference the round. This is round two. And the letter. That's 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 for you. There we go. Oh, you know what I forgot to mention, folks? Spin the wheel. That's right. That's right. Everybody who purchases something today will be entered to spin the wheel for free shipping. And you do not have to take advantage of that shipping today. You can make a big pile out of it and get free shipping. That's right. So at the end of this 10th round, we will spin the wheel for free shipping. Oh, I got claims here. Let me go ahead and get Jaguar. Chikata. His books. Okay. Old Wolf is in the house. He said, I received my books today. You packed them very well. Let me go ahead and display that for everybody watching on the rewind. Thank you very much, Old Wolf. I really appreciate that. Yeah. Hey, I don't disagree with you. Let's go ahead and Hulk smash that like for me. I dig it. Okay, so we got Jaguars taking letter H and letter J for $1. Jaguar, $1 claims. J and H is such a I'm gonna come this way. H and J are off the board in round two. Played. <laughs> that is very funny, that old comic smell. By the way, you had a book uh gifted to you by Chad RCG in your pile now. Chad went all Santa Claus yesterday. Okay, let's see. Uh, we're going to give this a couple more seconds before we go ahead and close out round two and move to round three. We've got 20 people watching in the live chat right now. Thank you very much for stopping by. Much appreciated. Nice. If you are watching this on the rewind, go ahead and reference the round and the letter, and I can go ahead and start a pile for you or add to a pile you may already have. We'll go ahead and close out round two. Round two is now closed. Good round. Really good books. Good round. So closed round two. 
And I'm going to go ahead and switch to you guys again, and we will get this overlay off of you guys. And I'll swap the board. That was a good round. Yeah. So we're going to go uh, – today I mixed it up a little bit, actually. We're, uh, we're going to go three rounds of $1, four rounds of $3, two rounds of 5 one round of 20 and wait till you see what I bust out on the 20 Oh, yeah. I adjusted the camera. I adjusted the camera for a reason. Can't wait, can't wait, can't wait. Is he going to get crazy? Come on, people. It could be crazy, Eddie. It could be. Hold on. Where is is, is 84 in the house? It could be crazy, Eddie, deals tonight. Crazy, Eddie, deals. Okay, okay, let's see what we've got here on the round three. This is the last dollar round. And we'll go ahead and pop that on, pop this on. And it's going to start with Iron Patriot number one, holding down the D position for $1. Invaders number one. That is a really nice cover for a buck. Come on now. Can't pass that up for a buck. Dark Rain Hawkeye, number one of five for only $1. Next up, we've got Catwoman number three from the new 52. And fill that run there with issue number three. This one I'm surprised still here. Punish your nightmare. Number one for a dollar. I know I got some Punisher fans out there. Green Lanterns and the New Guardians, number eight. For my DC fans, Fantastic Four number 53, $1. $1. Justice, League, Justice Society of America issue number seven for a dollar. Number seven. Batwoman number seven with that crazy yeah. scarecrow cover. Look at that. Oh, that's a nice one. That's nice. $1. <laughs> I don't know why, but this isn't a Mylar, but I don't read Aquaman. But there he is for a dollar. Aquaman 22. I know it's a nice cover. Maybe it's a key. I don't know. Exiles, number one. One dollar. Cute cover with that little Wolverine on there. And the la last book in the final one dollar round is Doctor Strange, number 76. Go to the A position. Let's go ahead and get round three started. The final one dollar round. Also, pop in and say er hi to everybody else that's joining me in the live chat. We've got Knights of Old. Says, is this a White Wednesday sale? Sure, we'll call it whatever you want, man. All right, up the down seven says $20 round is going to be 12 issues of Hulk 181. Ooh, not quite, but notice I've left some space here because the final rounds got four things that are taller than the rest. We already have books gone. Okay, let's see what we've got in this round. We've got Zach B says, give me B. Which is there. Zach B is taking B. And... Everyone, make sure you're using capital letters. Jaguar, is that an I or an L? We want to make sure. Yeah. Oh, yes. Good call. I, maybe I should change that. That's a really good call because this is the second time that's happened. So what I'm going to do for Jaguar is he gets I or L claim first, you know, just in case someone pops in there. Okay, so we have uh, comics, e for for comics for All People. Comics for All People says, you know what? Go ahead and throw E in my pile. Because I'm going to spin the wheel for free shipping today. Okay, so that is a capital I for Jaguar. That's the one he wants. Man, he always liked that. I ah, comic at 84. And okay, and I JB has all capital letters there. We're going to go by what the capital letter is. So make sure you put it as a capital letter so there's no confusion. I'm missing. I'm missing... I'm missing E. Am I mi yeah, I'm missing E. Exiles for comics for all people. Uh, I took the Aquaman one. Damn it. I'm trying to look it up. Uh, I did. It's not a key. Yeah, but I got that Aquaman one. I don't know if I had the issue. Comics for all people is now in the spin the wheel. We've got three rounds. We've got three contestants spinning for free shipping today. Hey. I'm being lurked. And guess what? We've got more people in the chat. What's hey. up? Biggest shacks in the house. All right. So this is what, what we're going to do. Dude? Close out this round. Let me get this overlay off your face. Sorry about that, fellas. And right, I'm going to go ahead and close out that round. That was a good round. If you're interested in any of those dollar books, that was round three. Round three is now closed. Let me go ahead and set up the round Four, which will be three dollar books. Closed 
round three. So what's new? Biggie, what have you been up to today? Oh, dude, let me show you this this magazine, bro. Oh, Check yeah. Show me the banger, Biggie. What is this? Devilina. Now, Devilina. again, I, I, on the magazine stuff, because I have been asking a lot of people recently, um, do you have anything to put that in? I mean, do you have like a magazine box? No, not really. I, I just no, keep it on. I don't. I'll just stack them either. up. 18 yeah. years older, please. Thank you very much. Oh, a CPC go. box will double for a magazine box if you need to use one for the other. What, what's that? A CGC box doubles as a magazine box. Oh, well, I'm about to get my first CGC box here pretty soon. Let's see here. Just, just so that we know anybody that's watching this show is 18 and over. There is a parental advisory and there is a parental. We got potty mouths, people. We're adults. We got potty mouths. I can't help it. Every once in a while, I get a shit or a fuck just drops right out of my mouth. I don't know how to That's stop true. it. Nice. So, <laughs> instead of that, I just go ahead and throw that advisory on there, Marcus, for adults, and hopefully everyone's cool with that. All right. Let's see what we got bitch, here. Dude. Oh, you you get, you're giving me the... Uh, he's, he's flexing out right now. Okay, so now we are going to the first $3 round here. I got some definitely some interesting stuff in here. I don't know how we decided, but remember... If you're wondering how do I decide wh what these books are, there's another show where, <laughs> where you can be part of it too. And you can help me decide how much to try and sell these books for. So the first book in the $3 round, I've got Batman Beyond number two. Bring nice. down the bat. Nice. I don't know why. Firefly number one Firefly. from Boom Studios. If you're a fan, America versus the Justice Society number three. Ooh. The Green Lantern number 22. And this is weird. Why would somebody have... There's like three backing boards in this thing. You know? It makes it feel real nice, but is there something special about it? Nah. All right. Deathstroke one number 38. That's a good one right there, too. I like that cover. Okay, now here's some new ones. Garth Ennis Run, Clayton Crane, Ghost Rider number five of six. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Boom! That's a nice looking one. Bah, 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 boom. Tony Stark, Iron Man number seven. Ooh. Stan Lee. That crazy. crazy. That's a crazy one. How about Deadpool number 10? Look at that cover. Deadpool. First appearance, Nightfall, dude. Bam! Three bucks, broski. Right there. Claim it, letter J. Spider-Man, Deadpool number one. Spider-Man, Deadpool number one. Oh, how many of these do I have? How many of these do I have? Oh, uh, when that came out. <laughs> Only one less after this round. You was opening boxes. You kept getting them. I had one of those in there. It's like I had it in two different pre-books. Oh. Here's another Garth Ennis Clayton Crane, number two of six. Look at that cover. Fire, $3. That's nice. And the final book in the round, Journey into the Unknown Worlds, number one. That's going to go right here in the A right. position. Let's get the starting line going. And once again, thank the 23 people who are watching us live right now. Thanks for joining us. We are in round four, the first of the $3 rounds. If you're catching this on the replay, just reference round four in the letter. And you can claim a book in the chat below. Or what? you can claim. Okay, time. Terry, go ahead. E in again before someone else does because we're doing one letter per two. Right, capital letters because sometimes we get confused with the So audience. that would mean Terry definitely has K. Uh -huh. He definitely has K. Still nobody's claimed D, so he can still grab it. And then uh, up the down seven is coming in with an I. Yep. I yep. Up the exactly. down. Zach exactly. already has that the next two. And up then the uh, we have Zach B getting two books. J and B. J and B. And Theory did come in with that second E before anyone else, so he's got them both. Zach B. Okay, so let's start. The, I, I, first, I made tags. We're going to start with Theory. So he got K and E. Yeah, he yes. said, K and E. He said, yeah, I'll take the Ghost Riders. Yep. He I'll take, the, I'll take those, the, those are both from... Green, Garth, and his Ghost, Ghost Riders. Yes, nice. they're both from a mini called Road to Damnation with Clayton Crane doing cover and interior art. Ooh, I love it when the knowledge gets dropped. All right, up and down sevens next. You got I, which is the uh, Spider Man uh, Deadpool right there, number one. Up the down seven. You got I, all the way in the front. 
Yep, right, right there. There you go. Up the down takes I. All right, so Zach B's got J and B. Zach B says, I like J. Yeah, this yeah. was a key. That was the one to get, right? And yeah. the Iron Man one, the standing up. And uh, he and, also uh, got B. Bam. Yeah, that's, that's it. it. You got it. Dude, Zach, you're killing it. Great job, man. Everybody, else, right. everybody else grab. Come on, $3 books, man. Look at that. All right. So, man, that was a great round of $3 books there. What are you taking, Javi? Looks like Javi wants something. What did Javi? Oh, did I miss it? You know, the I, the StreamYard chat is really, really, really slow. Like, really slow. Conquistador says Garth Ennis can't. He's amazing. You know All it. All you have to do is type in the letter. Just go ahead and type in the letter. I don't see anything in the chat. Uh, yeah, he, he hadn't claimed one yet, but it looks like he was really thinking about it. Uh-huh. Yeah. It's all right. All right. So we're going to go ahead and close this round four. If you're watching this on the Rewind, you can go ahead and claim a book by referencing round four in the letter in the comments below or even on my Instagram. So let me go ahead and get this back to here. Take this branding off of you guys. Where is it at? That one. And I'm going to swap the books. That was a great round, fellas. Man, we've got lots yeah. of people who are going to be spinning the wheel for free shipping. Spin that wheel. Spin that yeah. wheel for free shipping. Last you know, who, you know who's got to win. Comics, for all, in the comics for all people has to win because he's got a stack. And I yeah, he needs to get free shipping. Yeah, my my crazy Eddie D. I got to change that bag. Let me have to dig it. No one discovered yeah, that's, uh, that's an actual vendor I've been to. His oh. name is Crazy Ed. I know. With my luck, I'm going to get freaking sued. So we'll get that off of there. <laughs> All right, next round is again a $3 round. Let me get the overlay up. Let's get the camera on it. And we are starting with Cable and Deadpool Annual number one. Mm. Oh, $3. Annual. Road of the Dead number three. Oh, that's in there. $3. You're dead. Deadpool versus the Punisher number three. Look at that cover. That's a lot of dead. Dude, look at this cover. Yeah. I love it. At three dead in a row. Three dollars. Here's one. Uh, Action Comics 990. A lenticular. The Oz effect. Ooh, okay. nice. Oh, nice. That's, That's a good nice. book, dude. That's, That's a, good a great. Book. Book. Wait That's a minute, Mickey. Claim it. Claim it. It's going to be right here and let I us see. I already got it, dude. I got, the, I got the one where he breaks the chain. The Green Lantern number two. I got that one. That's oh, variant. Book. Nice. Very nice variant right there. Uh, this is another one like that, Wonder Woman. If you miss it this round, you may oh. see it again. There you go. That's a ten dollars. Three dollars. Three dollar book right now. Three dollars. Hack slash chaos number one again. Three dollars. I believe that is also a variant. How about Secret Empire number three? Look at that cover. Ooh. Wow. A lot of characters. A lot of characters going on there. Next up, we've got. Oh, this is an interesting. Oh, how, oh, I set this up wrong. Gosh darn it! Can I change the letters? Will I mess everybody up if I change the letters? All right, we didn't start yet. Nobody bit yeah. up. We do anything. Yeah, we haven't put the starting line in yet. I don't want to mess anybody all up, but I wanted to put this across the top, and I forgot about this. So, we will go. Adventures of the Super Sons. Four, three, two, and one. There we go. Okay, a full set of Super Sons available. Going across the top, four, three, two, one. This is round five, right? Are we round five? I always mess this up, man. Are we round five? One, two, three, four. Five. Yes, this is round five. We're going to start round five. And there's the starting line. Thank you, the 18 people who are joining me live. If you're interested in any of these books for $3, go ahead and place a claim by entering the letter in the comment section. We've already got live claims. BLC is wanting I. Mm. BLC. Jumping on it. BL it's not going in the other box, dude. I am not touched. It's so packed. It's packed so perfect. That other <laughs> box is closed. It's almost, a, it's perfect. I should have videotaped it. Well, I'm trying to get that free shipping on this. <laughs> oh, BLC says I got to spin the wheel for free I shipping. Spin the wheel. I'm in now. And, uh, ah, got Zach B with letter L. He is in the running. 
Okay. Zach B, you said with letter L, which is yeah. all the way on the other side. Yep. Got it. Zach B, letter L. <laughs> C was quick on that one. Nice. Mm. All right. So we are cranking right along. I think uh, we all, what do you think? Give it another couple seconds. Uh, all right. Closed round five. Let's go ahead and switch the camera to you guys. Thanks for helping me out today. I really appreciate you guys being here today. I keep kind of remember that is in branding. Overlays are in branding. I'm going to go ahead and close out that round five. Move to round six, another $3 round. If there was something that you see there on the rewind, go ahead and hit me up on Instagram or drop me a comment below, and I can go ahead and pull those books for you. I'm keeping them in order of their rounds, so they're very easy to pull the next day. Now, let's right, so get... We're taking a, a content survey. Do you like crunchy... Oh, they like po oh, that's right let's get we got to go back we got some different people watching us now we did have a little uh survey early on we said crunchy or puff for your cheese puffs just type it in yeah for your cheese puff. Just, you you like crunchy or puff. just type in your votes in the chat One. here's the next round of three dollar books and it's going to start with wonder woman number 58 no, mm -hmm. wonder woman. Mm -hmm. very nice in the d position high level number one I don't know. It's something, something about that book. I can't remember what it is, but something, there's something, something is in going in the H. Tales of Science. John Carpenter's Tales of Science Fiction. Looks like going somebody. Sharky the Bounty Hunter. Number oh. one. Transformers and Ghostbusters. Number one. Who are you going to call? Ghostbusters. Right. Moonshine. Number one from Image Comics. Yeah, it's also a good drink, too. If you moonshine. Get yourself some moonshine. Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man, number one. No, I got that one. I got, got that one for $3. There we go. Joker and Daffy Duck. I thought it was going to go less yesterday. It didn't go. Another one. How about a Xenoscope? Ripley's Believe It or Not, number one. $3. The Green Lantern number three. Oh, look at that one. Look at that cover. A lot of Green lanterns, lanterns over there. Here's another Green Lantern. Uh, Secret Origins Part One, the Jeff Johns run. Number mm -hmm. nine. What is that? Green Lantern number 29, Secret Origins Part One. That's a nice one. Drop that up there. And then the final book in this round is going to be Female Furies number one. That's going to go in the A position. Let's go ahead and get that starting line going. If you're just joining us, thank you very much for popping in. This is a buy it now opportunity. If you're joining us live, go ahead and drop a letter below underneath the starting line with a claim on a book, and I can put that aside for you. If you're catching this on the rewind, go ahead and reference the round. This is round six, I believe. And the letter, and I can go ahead and start a pile or add to your pile. So BLC uh, says, give me D. Bam. Wonder, Wonder Woman. Here he said I was going to go for E. Wrong. Now that high level is a key, guys, as well as I think one of the Green Lantern books. Also, folks, everybody that's participating, participating in the live chat today will spin the wheel for free shipping. That is right, free shipping on your entire order, and you do not have to just get today's books. And Zach that. B wants letter A. He wants that big Barda. Oh, letter A. Uh, nobody wants Daffy Duck. All right, all right, all right. We've got one more round of $3 books. We're going to hit two. That letter H for Zach as well. He wants it as well. Letter a. Man, you're seeing it so much sooner than I'm seeing it. That's because I'm looking on the actual YouTube page. Yeah, YouTube's quicker. Okay. Thank you very much, Zach B. He is going to be spinning the wheel for some free shipping also. He's got a little pile started over here. If you don't have a pile, let's get one started. If you've got one, let's add to it. We've got 
Three more, what is that? Four more rounds total, one more round of three dollars, two rounds of five dollars, and one round of twenty dollars that hopefully will surprise you. Ooh, surprise, surprise. We're gonna go ahead and close out this round. This was uh what was this? Round six? Yes, it was. Round yeah. six. No. Close round six. Thank you, the 20 people that are joining us live. I really appreciate your attendance here. During the comic book pop-up shop, let's go ahead and change this camera back. We close that round. Drop this banners off the branding off your face. And get to the next round. That was a nice round. What did you guys think of that one? Pretty good. It had some keys going on there. Got some keys. Got some great covers. That's a good round. Terry took a guess. He thought I was going for E, and he was wrong. I went for letter D. Ooh, okay, was- here's the final $3 round before we get to a couple of rounds of fives and one round of 20s. Let's get my – I keep forgetting. It's in branding, folks. It is in branding. There's the overlay. Hey. Hello there, Splash Page. Just saw you. Hey, Splash Page. Splash Page? Oh, man, Splash Page. Awesome. If I wonder where, can you send me an empty box? Ah, ah, you're awesome. By the way, man, if you didn't see Splash Page and I were guests for um, um, the comic Robert. book G Bots, and yeah. Splash took over in the, at the end and just blew everyone away with yeah, his it was nuts. All right, let me get to the last three dollar round here. We've got Black Order number one. Is that a variant cover? No, this is cover A. Right there for three dollars. How about Black Cat number one? If you didn't get one, get one cheap. Three dollars right here. Add it on your pile. Batman Strikes number thirteen. There you go. How about Guardians of the Galaxy number six? You didn't get it. it just, I know it just came out recently, but there it is. Generations number one. Deathstroke seven. We still got a couple of these Batman and the Max series. I got number three left. Hey, here's one. Star Trek, issue number one, The Q Conflict. Nice. That one for $3. Convergence number one. How about Spider-Gwen, Ghost Spider number nine? Ooh. Here's issue number one of Batman Max Arkham Dreams. Put that in the A position. And the final book here is Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man number eight. Three dollars. Let me see that. Set these all up here, and let's get the starting line in there. For what is this round seven? Round seven is now open to the live chat to the twenty-six people that are joining us live. Thank you very much for joining us, and welcome to the pop up. I got that one. I got that friend in the neighborhood. One. I got that. Uh, This is the show where I'm offering a buy it now opportunity. What I like to call the keep it thorough starting line style. If you're joining us live, if you're watching the replay, just go ahead and reference the round number in the letter and you can drop it in the comment below or you can hit me up on Instagram. So this is the final $3 round. It is now open to the live chat. Feel free to claim a book by dropping a letter. Then we're going to do two rounds of $5 books, which I got a couple of interesting packs in there. And then we're going to do one round of 20s. And then we're just going to chop it up for a little while because that's what we like to do on this channel. We like to chat with the community. I got Jigs King. Yeah. Bit B. And G. And, and K. K. Jigs. You all paid up from yesterday, Jigs, by the way. So you got free shipping out here. All He's already in. Man, he, he's getting B, G, and K. I'm going to put you on the wheel and give you the credit if you win it because you already paid for your shipping yesterday. B, G, and K. All right. He says, give me the Star Trek. I'll B, take it. G, Deathstroke, and then the I'll Generations. Take Deathstroke. And yeah. the Generations won. I like I'm B, sure dude. Over now. Ha, 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 ha. So Jig says, give me those five books, throw them in my pile. My shipping's already taken care of, but I might be getting a credit if I win the wheel. Is racking up, Jigs. Very nice. Jigs had a great night last night on that auction, man. He was killing it, man. 
bought a whole Can't bunch. Man, of I hope you do these unboxings live, Jigs, because you had a great night. He's a savage. He's a savage. savage. Okay, that He's was driving. round seven. We why why gotta make sure you're in the thing. Closed round seven. We'll go ahead and close round seven. Change the camera over here. Get this overlay off of your guys' face. Let me go ahead and get the board set up for a $5 round. We've got two of those. We've got two rounds of five left. We've got one round of 20, and then we're just going to sit and chill for a little bit. Thanks for joining us. Biggie, thanks for joining me. Big Will, Patrick, man, your help has been phenomenal. And oh, by the way, I really love you fucking guys, man. Holy shit. <laughs> hey wasn't that jigs that just got a cgc's back i think he got first blade and first ghost rider and just see that right now jigs killing the game yeah. all right here we go jb's got some five dollar books here i had to make some decisions and you know what when i just said you know what we're gonna take some of these ten dollar books we're gonna move them down because that's what you gotta do so now we're going to go with some $5 books. Let's get the overlay on. And we are going to start with a gorgeous copy of Mira, Queen of Atlantis, number one. Hot so, damn. That's an excellent book. Silver shiny goodness for only $5. We're going to go ahead and put that in the D position. I've got a $9.99 cover price of Mysteries of Love in Space, never been read. Get that half price right now, $5. Right there. Conan the Barbarian, number one, Scotty Young. Yep. I'm going to put him in the L position for $5. The Invisible Woman, number two. This cover is gorgeous. Right there. New Gods, number one. Here's a new one you haven't seen yet. Deceased, number two of six. But right, wait, wait, wait. It comes with a COA. Very interesting. It must be a variant of some sort, but guess what? You can claim it in position K. I move this one down. Let's go Flintstones number one, Hanna-Barbera. Great looking copy. All right there. And Here's another round. Batgirl number 34 signed. Move that one down from a $10 book to a $5 book. You can pick that copy up signed right now for only $5. Then I went through and found some higher grade stuff that you just won't aren't going to believe. Check out the copy of Wonder Woman 282 with a Joker on the cover. I'm going to offer that up for $5 to whoever jumps on that first. How about Hawkman number one? Oh, yeah. That's going to be available for $5. This is a beautiful cover of Batwoman number three. That is available right here in the I position. And the final book in the first $5 round is Conan the Barbarian, number four, the Spider Villains variant. Banger. Oh, Banger look book. Discovery. Look at Discovery killing the game. There we go. Excellent round. This is the round I have. The starting line is up and they are off. Thank you to the 27 people who are joining me in the live chat. This is the buy it now opportunity. Oh, wow. So, um, again, the claims must be after the starting line, folks. The claims must be after the yeah, starting line. Uh, looks like we have BLC, first one after the starting line with letter D. He got letter D. <laughs> BLC. Come on, y'all. These are bangers, dude. There's at least three or four bangers. That's the floor. Look at it. Look at that E, y'all. That Hawkman yeah. number one, brother. You, you kidding me, man? And then uh, we have Teary with letter F. Nice. And that old comic smell has letter K. Damn. Got hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So what was Teary was next? F. 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 Yeah. Man, dude, Teary, you scored, bro. You're gonna go. You're gonna get this home. And you're gonna go. Holy jeez! Hold on, hold on. You know what I'm gonna do? You know it's coming. You're gonna get that thing home and say, "Holy shit! This thing's gorgeous." Thanks, Terry. <laughs>
All right, what's my next one? Who is the next? old comic smell? Letter K. So the right. old comics, and were we doing this in order here? Did I am I am I going in the the right order? I, it looks I feel like I, I I no okay. What about a uh, Jaguar? No, he was doing. Oh, I see what happened. Okay, the old comics smell. I'm just gonna listen to you. I'll shut up now. That old <laughs> comic. Hi, kids um, got help. Comic smell five dollar book. And that was Letter K, that deceased yeah. man. You swooped. Dude, this thing says Jing John Gang Comics exclusive. 3,000 of cover A were printed and 1,500 of the lowest grade copies were destroyed. So there's only 500. No, 1,500. This is number 993. Wow, what a score. Five bucks. That old comic smell. Then we have Jig's Kingdom with letter L, the Conan book in the corner. Got it. Hey, we got letter A for BLC. BLC says, I'll take Hawkman number one. Then we have uh, Teary picking up I. He wants that Catwoman. Yep. Hey, who's that book signed by Discovery? Hold on. This one right here? This Catwoman? Okay. I? Yes. For Teary? And I have no one else claiming a book on my screen here. Everything's either already been claimed yep. or no yeah. one's claimed it. Hey, who is this signed by? That is a great question, Biggie. I really have no idea. There's no notes. I knew. I do know that it came from Billy at Economics because he's got his little. His, he's got nine point four to nine point six written on the back. All right, but I can't tell. I can't. <laughs> oh, stop it! Come on, Biggie. All right, oh, here no, we go. Man. I'm just joking. So we're gonna go ahead and close round eight. That was a great round. Five dollar books there. And let's go ahead and get you guys back on camera. Get this overlay. I got to wait for the starting lineup. Stop. Uh, there was two little bids before the starting lineup. And, and, and so I'm we're going to move to the next $5 round. Before we get to. Oh. Okay. So this will be the last $5 round. Oh. And then we're going to get to a $120 round. Then we're going to chat it up. Spin the wheel for free shipping. Because you know we got to have some free shipping. And here we go. First book up, we've got a beautiful copy of Doctor Strange number four variant edition, Return of the Fantastic Four variant. Wow. Gorgeous copy, too. Okay, now there are four books in here. There are four or five books in here. One, two, three. There are four books in here in the Joker's Asylum run. Poison Ivy, Scarecrow, um who else is in here two-face and penguin all four books five bucks oh, we have hialeah joining us hialeah comic bro i just love saying that i just love saying that <laughs> all right next up ash versus the army of darkness number three some variant of some sort here five dollars how about Deathlock number one through five all together packaged up nicely? Five dollars, one through five, right there. Here is DC Superstars The Flash number 33, and it's a pretty nice looking copy. VF near mint. Little nope, it says right there, only five dollars. Doomsday Clock number one of 12. Right there in the G position. Winter Soldier number three. Right here. Starboy number one. Thorough was telling me about that. That should be a deal at five bucks. That was in the ten Winter dollar. Soldier is a key. Old Man Hawkeye number 12, which is also first appearance of Old Man Murdoch on the final page. Oh, I got that. Cool. Batgirl number 33 up here. And then these last two for $5 were something out of that Spider-Man booth with $15 price tags on it. We have Leviathan number one, an exclusive over here in Venom. 
So this is the final $5 round. I've got 29 people joining me live. Thank you very much. Let's get the starting line going. There you go. If you are interested in any of these $5 books and you're joining me live, go ahead and drop a claim below. If you're catching this on the rewind, just reference the round number and the letter and I can get a pile started or I can add to a pile you've already got going. Shipping rates are as wise. And after this, we are spinning the wheel for some free shipping. Letter C is gone. Up the down seven. Up the down. Zach B got G. Up the down. We got the doomsday clock. Up the down. What was it? What, what did up down? Up the down get? Where is he at? You got C. You got the poison ivy. The what is it? He took the whole set. Yeah, I'll take four that. books for five dollars. And Zach G's next. He's got the doomsday clock. Up the down. And Zach B, I think he's already got a five. Does he? No, he does not. So Zach, we have a letter K for comics for all people. All right, Zach B was what? Zach B was G. 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 Doomsday clock. Doomsday clock. Right, right next to Starboy. Right there. There you go. Zach B. There you go. All right, like you said, comics for all people got K, so he beat out Jigs on my screen. Yeah. Uh, so let me. Let me see on my screen. I've got, uh, yeah, I got comics for all people. Got okay. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Human X bid thirty. I don't know what thirty for. But... Yeah. Okay. okay. Then we have a letter F goes okay. to all right. Pick up on K comics for all people. Jaguars F. He got Star Boy. Jaguars got Star Boy. Oh, and Human X was just saying there's over 30 of us in here now. Oh, oh wow, man. This is spiky and this is great. Oh, so who do we got left? Jaguar is going F? Yeah, yeah. He's Star Boy. He's got Star Boy. Ja he says he that's a deal. I know it. I heard Thoreau say it. That's a deal. And uh, Jimmy, I, I don't know if you meant to add the R on there to say something or if you're wanting letter H. Can you clarify, please? Yeah, I believe it's H. <laughs> Terry says, "Jigs, sell me your sell me your doubles." <laughs> That's awesome. Sell me your doubles, bro. I love it. Comically flawed in the house. How you doing, Adam? That was fun last night, man. You were, by the way, Adam. You were catching some hell last night. But I'll tell you what. If that show was supposed to be coming for the deals and stand for the laughs, you were the laughs. That was the best part of it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man, it was good times. Splash page, throw some Silver Age Marvel out there. Ooh, man, I got, maybe I'll do a whole episode of some Silver Age Marvel, huh? There you go. Hey. Are we done with all the claims? Did I get everybody? Yeah, I think that's cool. it. Cool H for Cheery, and then he can tell us if that's for sure one he wants or not. I think he claimed it. Yeah, Theory. Hey, theory, did you want a letter in this round? You wanted H because you put H R, so we're thinking you you wanted H. Yeah, we're thinking he wanted that sketch, but we need clarification here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. H -R -H -R -R. We're going to close this round. That is the end of round nine. Let's go ahead and see what craziness JB has got set up for round ten. Hey, we've got a first time watcher here, and he's from Milpitas, California. How you doing, man? You're a local boy. Thank you. He was abbreviating the word hour. He did not claim it. So you're good. Gotcha. 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 Jigs, we do need to have a couple of beers. I bet you we would have a great time. All right. So we're going to go ahead and close this round. That round is closed. We got one more round. It's a $20 round, and it's going to be crazy. Dollar round coming up next. So people come and hang out to see. Okay, that's the end of round nine. Now we're going to get to round 10. We are making great time. This is the 10th and final round. Let's get to the overlay, the $20 overlay. We're going to switch to here. Oh, th this is all fire, right? Well, you've seen the first eight books, but nobody's seen these last four books on this pop-up shop show before. So... Mm -hmm. We're going to try again with Venom number one, but I'm not using anything in the top row because I got to keep that row open. Amazing Spider-Man number 800, that Tyler Kirkham variant. Nice. Beautiful, beautiful, $20. 
Another 800 variant edition. We'll put you right next to this one. This one has a certificate of authenticity on the back of it. For Black Cat number one. Still has its little factory seal sticker. Drop that on there. Half price of what it's asking. New Agents of Atlas number one variant. Drop that in there. Red Sonia, Birth of the She-Devil. Beautiful copy of that. Dropping that here. Hey, if you saw my Instagram post, there it is. That Venom number one. And how about a very, very nice copy of Gen 13 number one. Some Jim Lee goodness. Go. And for the final four books. Oh! Slabs, my friend. We are putting slabs up. Twenty dollars. No, the screen is cutting off the grade. Yeah. We'll move it up. I don't know if I get all four in here. Maybe. Oh, they don't trust. Those human torches look familiar. Don't they? Yeah. Are they all nine point eight, JB? You're cutting they off. They are the not. I'm going to adjust the camera. So I believe I got to do up. That's there good. Nine four nine six nine eight nine eight. Are we are we there? Do I still adjust? A little bit higher. There you go. Perfect. Yeah, that, that that'll work good enough. We can tell what goes where. Okay, so from left to right, let me explain what we've got here. In the letter D position, we've got Captain America Steve Rogers, issue number five, 9.8 white pages. In the letter C position, we've got Captain America Steve Rogers, number six, 9.8 white pages. In the letter B position, we've got the Human Torch, number one, 9.6 white pages. Never been pressed. Over here, we've got Human Torch, number 10, 9.4 white pages. Never been pressed. Let's get the starting line out there and see if there's anybody interested in adding any of these to their piles. So, gentlemen, Ooh. man, what do you think? Coming a little bit I different on that. Uh, <laughs> anybody ever done that before? What? Just go ahead. What? $20 what? slab? Yeah, just dropping them out there like that. I'm going to buy it now. Uh, K and L. Says, Give me K and L. I'm tired of seeing them. <laughs> Ooh, Javi wants J. K and L. What? what a beast. No, but you gotta be kidding me. Nobody's grabbed a slab yet. Uh, letter oh. H is the Venom variant. So, Javi, did you say Javi is J? Javi wants J. Javi takes that J. Which this one says it is one of 500 copies in existence. One of 500 nice. copies in existence. They Very did. nice they did pickup did there, Avi. Uh, Jig's Kingdom is wanting C and D. There you go. That's my boy. Jig's Kingdom says, you know what? I've already got a pile going. Let's just go ahead and change the box size. <laughs> Uh, Comic Head 84 wants to know the artist for the cover I. Uh, one second, let's find out. Okay, artist for cover I. Yep. Uh, Jay Adicleto? Adicleto? Hmm. Let's see if I can get it close enough. You can read it. Come on, come on. Delgado? I can't tell. Okay. Yeah. Should I open it? I can open it. Want. Kenny, if you if this is it and no one else, we can talk about that one later. All right, I think I'll go ahead and close out this round. Yeah, the final be. round. 
Where'd you get those uh, human torch slabs? They're nice. I know those human torch ones are awesome. They're probably one of the first slabs I've ever bought on any auction. Uh, the ebook is the Gen 13, Gen 13 right? number one. Beautiful copy by Jim Lee, but a really nice copy. Oh, yes, definitely, sir. Uh, Jigs Kingdom wants A and B. He's taking all, all right. the slabs. <laughs> <laughs> Jigs, you're the best, bro. He's riding high, dude. Jigs. Says I'll take all four. Okay, uh, Comic Head and Zach B, you were both questioning about books. Okay, 84 said sold. He'll take the eye, that virgin you were showing. There you go, 84. Oh, oh okay, good. Boom. Now that was a round. Wow. Yeah, good job. Well, right. So Dave let's... Enrique says, if you didn't know that Gen 13 is a second printing. No, I did not know. Please. Really? I did don't think it know. matters that much, does it? Well, it's it's exactly good. Pass, a so... book. It should maybe it should be in the tens. I'm gonna move it down to 10 next time. Thank you, sir. Thank you for the information, Dave. All right, well, that go ahead and close round three. There's only three books left in there. Wow, what a round, what a round, what a round. Let's go ahead and – hold on. What? Right? Man, that was crazy <laughs> round. That wow, was in this is buying a whole bunch of slats, man. Those human torches, man. This camera back to the main camera and say, Wow, thank you, everybody who joined me for this edition of the comic book pop up shop. This has been crazy. Great edition. Now we can just chat. Let me go ahead and clean up this area real quick and get let me get your guys' thoughts. What do you think? All right. Gentlemen, anybody? I got 29 people in the chat. Don't let me go dead over, no, baby. Hey, hey Discovery. <laughs> Hey, bro, yeah, I got I got to start getting ready for the next show. I think Big 90 is going to do something, so I'm going to hop okay, out of here, man. I'm ready ready for spinning. I got to get the wheel ready for free shipping. Oh, yeah. Y'all All, right. Right. All right. So let me go ahead and get the wheel out. I got the uh, spin the wheel here. Let me go ahead and get the names. Make Dude. sure I get everybody. I don't want to leave any anybody out. Do First, we're going to do room? all these off. And I know that oh, some of you guys, I appreciate you discovering. Hey, Pat, thank Big you Will. very much. Later, man. Later. You do Shaq in that house. Let me go ahead and change this so that I don't got Patrick up down there. Move you up there. So let's go ahead and my clear my, the board. Yeah, icon. Let's go ahead and clear the board and then put it back. Jigs, Ch Chad's not here. All right. Zach B is in. BLC is in. Jigs is in. Comic Head 84 is in. Okay, so I need new ones. Zaggy BLC got all those. 84. Should I pop the bubble? Gary, Avi, up the downs already got free shipping, so he doesn't have to be in because he's got free shipping. But let's go ahead and add Terry to the list. Terry's in the run in. Come on, free shipping. Dude, you got Zach B on there? Jaguar, Jaguar's in the mix for some free shipping. Jaguar, my fellow cat brother. Yeah. All right, who else do we have here? Zach's already there. How about uh, Javi? Oh, uh, Javi. Javi's already on, my, on the board, I believe. No, he's not. Thank you. Javi is in the, in the mix. And what about... DLC Comics for All is already... What about... Well, Comics for All has to be in there, right? Oh man, he needs the free shipping. <laughs> he, he's already said he's winning tonight. He's calling it. Yeah, he needs the shipping, boy. All right, is there anybody I'm missing? I think I uh, got everybody. Jaguar, Mac, BLC, Comics for All, Jigs, Terry. Up oh, the down, the up the down already had free shipping, so he's good. I think I got everybody. Okay. Right, let's, double checking. Here, I'll show you the board here. 
go ahead and switch my camera over to this board because this is the best part. Spinning the wheel. No whammies, no whammies, no, no whammies, whammies, right? Big money, big money, big money. So let yeah, just so you can see who's on the wheel here. All right, can you see the name? Yeah, looks like you got them all. He's too close, he's too close. Here, see. I don't even know which one's me. Wait a minute. DLC, you're right there. Orange. I'm on. I'm on. Zach B is green. Orange. I could deal with the orange. I'll take the orange. Bobby blue. Jaguar orange. Terry green. Comic head red. Jig blue. Are we ready? Come on, baby. Are we ready? One time, folks. One time spin for free shipping. Orange. There orange. it goes. There it goes. Where it stopped. No one knows. Red. 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 Damn it. Comic Head 84. Wow. Winner. Winner. Nice. Ooh. <laughs> 84 with the free shipping. Did, it, did everyone see it? All right. Good. Uh, let me switch this back. No. No. There we go. Comic Head 84 scores free shipping on this edition of the comic book pop-up shop. Excellent. Thank you for joining me, everyone. I will be taking photos and sending them via Instagram or email. Um, I did get that address that I needed from that old comic smell. Unfortunately, your box is packed. I don't know if I can fit anymore, but we'll start a new pile for you. Um, what else have we got? Man, this was another great addition. If there's anybody that's catching this on the rewind, just reference the round number in the letter, and I'll be sure to pull those for you. I pulled maybe about three or four books from yesterday's show. I've got them all lined up, and as long as they're still lined up before I do the next show, it's an easy pull. So, man, I'm going to have to really get to work and get some $20 books. I'm, you know what I think I'm going to have to do? We're going to have to go get into them Silver Age keys, man, because I know those are all worth about 20 bucks. Get up into some of that early... Uh, Early Silver Age doubles. I know I got them in there. So well, maybe that'll be the next uh, 20 round. We'll get some of that good stuff going. But man, the variants are hot too. What'd you guys think? Good show. Good show. Good show. Congratulations. Good stuff. All the Great show. Sure. Right? Man, that was really successful. When will the next auction be? Okay, so now th this is... I don't really consider this an auction. I kind of consider this a well, buy now. Not, so. <laughs> yeah, it's more like a sale. Uh, my next auction will be not this Thursday, but the following Thursday. That's the next time I will host an auction. But the next auction is this Saturday over at Big Lion Cats channel at... Are you going early? Are you going early? 7 o'clock. 7 o'clock. So 7 4 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Big Lion Cat will be hosting the Saturday auction. You know that one that goes eight hours? Yeah. yeah you know that one. It's like eight There's hours long. Friday pop auction. In, pop out, kind of leave it running in the background. That's what I do. And then just every once in a while, you'll see a book that pops up, and they'll be like, damn, JB was in here the whole time. Yeah, there's also a Friday auction on Lords of the Lombox. TiVo's doing a Black Friday auction. Comics for all people, I got you. I will definitely send you a total, and maybe we can switch boxes or something because uh, yours is packaged up so perfectly, but we can figure it out. Uh, this Friday, I am going to be on with Downright Nerdy Podcast. Yep, that's right. I'm going to be reviewing episode or season four of... Um, Star Trek The Next Generation. You know, with the release of the new Picard series, we went back and started looking. And I'll tell you what, I think that Star Trek The Next Generation's sweet spot was right in that, you know, season three, four, and five is right when it got good. So if you want to join us, that'll be on Friday. If you're not shopping, go ahead and uh, you're not shopping. You're going to you're watching YouTube, right? If you're watching me now, you're watching YouTube. You watch YouTube. So I'll probably see you on Friday uh, there. Uh, Conquistador says he's doing a 12 hour stream. No, Jig's Kingdom is going 7 p.m. to 7 a.m. What's going on here? Oh, no, he's talking about the next auction, probably. Yeah, that's what we need to do. BLC just do 12 hour auction live streams. Crazy, yeah. We need to go eight, and we, we probably Dude, I can barely go four rounds, man. I got the kids screaming at me, and it's just nuts. So, my Jigs, next auction, come on, Jigs, gotta slap. Yeah, my, you gotta my next auction. Huh? You gonna keep this time frame, JB? This been good for the for the pop up shop. Yeah, uh, I'll try and do this again for sure. This is this looks like it'll be a good time for a Monday through Friday kind of thing next week. If you know, I have enough books. I, I need to do another sorting show. We all know you have enough books. Well, I imagine know. If they're sorted or not. I got to get them sorted. I, I definitely need to sort some more books. You know. Plus, I was really worried about like 
I had this. I had Jessica Jones one, two, three in the dollar pile, and I just wasn't sure about that. Uh, the problem is, you know, but to have all one, two, and three, I just need to resort these. I just I feel like I I messed up what I had sorted. Do so. you have enough to do a, an age show like all considered modern, all bronze, all copper, all silver? Do you have enough to do yeah. that? I could definitely yeah, do so one or two like of the splash bronze. age. Yeah. Was, splash uh, onto something if I did a whole show as silver. See, yeah. but there is a dollar or three dollar silver guy. I mean, all the silver is going to be 10, 15, 20, 25, and that's in mediocre grade because that's what they go for. You well, know? who cares? Is, I mean, if you have enough for a silver show, then people will expect that pricing. That's true. That's true. That's true. So, if you guys are not following me, I'm also on Instagram. Uh, I like to sh do a lot of repost stuff and share stuff that's mostly associated to the schedule, per se. Uh, if you haven't checked out the page, I am kind of keeping track of everything that's going live on a daily basis and keeping that update with a keep that uh, with a what do we call it? A playlist. So I got a playlist for that, and I have a playlist for top list, top hits, and I've got a playlist for appearances because. I seem to be appearing on a bunch of shows. I was, you know, on uh, Inquiring Minds the other day, and then I was on Modern Men the day on Monday. So, ooh, what you got? You got books? You gonna show me some books? Oh, I know what else I wanted to do. After BLC up. shows off his book, I've gone. All up. right, I got two people here, right? Yep. I want you each to pick a number between one and twenty, and I am going to. Open a random package. 17. From, hold on, I don't know if you can see it with this camera. Can you see it with this camera? That pile, those two piles? I, yeah, I can see the pile in the back. Yeah, so I got two piles of books here. Pile A and pile B. And what we're going to do is you guys are going to pick a number and I'm going to randomly open that pot. I open that book. Okay. Yeah, so you said pile 17? B seventeen. Pile B seventeen. Pile B seventeen. Pile B seventeen from guess who? Comic Head eighty four. <laughs> Kenny, this is from you, bro. Looks like the post office went and. Did a oh, few I, things, I, so. I had already opened up, opened up to see, make sure the contents were of good. So I've got uh, an envelope uh, from Vasco, and then uh, it looks like I've got a slab here. Nice. Let's see what slab JB got from Chem Comic Kid eighty four. And uh, do you remember selling me this, Kenny? How long ago was this? Oh, it's not bad. It was October, man. Uh, I don't know if he's even still in here. I haven't seen him in a while. Come in. All right, let's see what we got here. We have. Oh, I saw it. Nice. Nice. Fantastic 446 and a CBCS 6.5. And that's the new label CBCS. I like those labels. Very nice. Man, that's a nice looking copy, too. Very nice copy. Hey. Now, what did I get from Vasco? Because there was two things in there. JB, do you have a smartphone handy? Yes, I do. Does it have a QR reader? Uh, yes, it does. Well, what's the grader's notes on that sucker? You can... Oh, shit. I don't know. Let's see. Yeah. One thing well, about they, are they free? They are 100% free. Every slab CBCS, you just scan the code and you have complete access to Grader's Notes. Yes. <laughs> Let's see what the Grader's Notes are on this guy. So, got 19 people joining me. Kenny from Comic Head 84 sent this to me. Uh, I do believe this was one of his auctions. And it says Fantastic 446. Notes. Ready? Spineware, creasing and stress bends, 
break cut no right, spine wear creasing and stress breaks color light edge and corner wear and creasing some breaks color light foxing back cover small vertical crease middle front cover oh shit no way yeah <laughs> very little yeah i didn't even notice it until you read it small vertical crease middle front cover and tiny scuff bottom left back cover breaks color wow that is so cool so it's free now it's not free for cgc right no it's it, it's free for cgc if you sent the book in yourself and only view them online to have a hard copy or view a book that you did not originally submit it's five dollars that is so cool so all right now let's see what we got from uh vasco because i got uh i got something from vasco too in this and then um Patrick, what number? You got pile A. Give me a number. Uh, let me take a look at the pile once you open that. I want to take a look at the pile. Okay. Ooh. Take the price off. Oh. Nice. Demon in a bottle. Oh, Demon in a man. bottle. Iron Man 128. Demon in a bottle. And uh, New yeah, stand. That's all right. And nice then cool. another... I have this, but I don't Nice. Avengers 55. So now this is an example. I probably got like three or four copies of this. I really? can put this up in a pop-up shop setting and it would there be roughly go. in that neighborhood, right? On a low, lower grade copy. Hey, that Splat might be an idea. idea. Set all those aside till you have enough. Right. Okay, so you want to see the pile again. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, and let's take a look at the pile. All right, let's take a look at the pile. We're going to go back over here. Now, uh, Big Lion Cat's going to pick so... Uh, I picked out of that pile last time. So this is A, and that was B. All right, so I'm talking A number five. One, two, three, four. Five. All right, let's see what we got here from Doomed Comics. Doomed Comics is an Instagram seller and a buddy of mine. He's just been killing the game recently. If you That's haven't true. seen some of the That's books true. that he's been putting up... He has been killing it recently. Let's see what I got from him. Oh, 84 just came back in. He missed that whole opening. 84, you missed it. I just opened. It? Here it is. 84, I finally opened this up. Finally opened this up. At, and then I got that, uh, that stuff from Vasco. All right. Let's see what we got here. Wow, this was clever as all hell, fellas. So it's a Gemini mailer, but because he put it in paper, he was able to ship that for $2.75. Oh, did he do media? Media mail, but it's still a Gemini mailer. Yeah. Yeah, it depends how you ship it. You know, you pay for it. So yeah, it doesn't matter. Yet. I've sent Geminis alone by themselves, no additional packing media before. Just got to be careful if they catch you. Yeah, yep. that's right. That's why you, I do priority. So not only was it in that, it's still encased in this. I have no idea what this is, fellas. I'm Definitely. gonna guess Silver Age. Run. I'm gonna guess something Silver yeah, Age. Gotta right be, now. gotta be with it. Coming from the Doom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotta no, be this is this is Doomed Comics, not Doom 143. Oh no. Oh, okay. No, not the Doom 143. This is Doomed Comics. Wonder if we're gonna be right. Well, my life is going to pull out a modern variant. <laughs> All right. Oh, Avengers. Uh, yeah, I saw something juicy. Oh, yeah. How about some Silver Age Avengers? I told you how to be good. Felt it. <clears throat> oh, it is good. Wow. All right, we'll go backwards. We'll start with it. Man, why couldn't you put them in a new bag and board at least? Man, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> nice. X-Men 45. But you know what? I'm gonna have to clean this one up. I think I just got that one. Is the uh, 12 cent X Men, and then was the reprint started, or did, was that later when the reprint know. started? I think it's later. No, I don't know. To be honest with you, you ready for this one? I do not have this one. Avengers number twelve. Wow. Nice. I believe that is Kirby. Yep. Dude, look at that cover. Mole, the mole man. Nice. Very. Very nice. 
That was courtesy of Doomed Comics. Uh, he's an Instagram seller and a really, really solid dude. Check him out. He's been absolutely changing the game, putting up some fire recently. Um, so definitely check out what he's got going on. He's doing some raffles too. I think he's putting up a uh, first appearance. Blade is up right now in a raffle that he's doing. So you may want to get on that. Do you have any books on the press right now? No, I only got this thing. I haven't even, I haven't even turned it on, Joe. I haven't even turned it on yet, but I got everything. I got my Teflon. I got my boards, the right thickness. I got my humidity Tupperware thing I'm going to use. I got everything I got. I just haven't fired it up yet. But when I ruin that book, Joe, I'll be sure to share it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So uh, the boy you had seven says, that's a gorgeous Avengers, JB. Thank you very much. Uh, what's that? Writer of Game of Thrones in the back of that Avengers book, Letter to Editor. How do you have knowledge like that, Kenny? Man, Kenny just dropping knowledge. Wait a minute, here's some more knowledge. Reprints didn't start till 75-ish, probably. Nice. nice. Read the directions first, JB. Nice. <laughs> Very cool. Now, I appreciate funny that. is that's a t-shirt press you bought, right? So yeah, the is. instructions would be for that, right? Yes, they are. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But, you know, I, I've... I've watched a lot of YouTube videos. <laughs> hey, they work sometimes. Yeah, definitely. All right, so that's something else we'll try. We'll try new. If you guys want to continue to this format at the end of the show, I'll go ahead and finally open up some of this shit because I get too much shit, and we'll uh, figure out what we got in some of these boxes. So you, you I'm going to go ahead and have people on for that. an hour and a half now, right? Wow. Yeah, I've gone. Yeah. I've gone on too long. I don't want to step on these shows. Um, thank you for, I mean, we held a great audience, almost 20 people. Yes, Scott Farr, your stuff's piled up right here on the side. I mean, almost, it's taller than my kids right now. I got to do a big unboxing um, of some Funko Pops. I've got one, two, three, four. I got five boxes of Funko Pops from Scott Farr to open up. Okay. To close, I want to say thank you guys one last time for joining me. Thanks, everybody in the chat for joining me. I'm having a blast doing this pop-up shop thing. I hope you guys are too. If you're watching it on the Rewind, you probably didn't watch it till the end. But if you did, go ahead and claim by just dropping me a comment on Instagram or dropping a comment below. Don't forget that this Saturday, Big Lion Cat is hosting that auction eight straight hours starting at 4 p.m. Pacific, 7 p.m. Eastern into the wee hours in the morning. And then... uh and then I'm doing a Friday thing, and then we'll just. Uh, you got anything, Big Will? You, you you're gonna guest appear? You got uh, anything? I am hopefully going to be doing some more React videos, but they With will the just be recorded. I'll release them uh, later. Nice. Hopefully yeah, I have not go crazy. Biggie Shack, you got anything you want to lay lay on us before we close it out? Uh, I got a 600 sub contest on my channel. Oh. Nice. And uh, Power Hour on Friday. Com everybody subscribe, my man, Comic Cat 84 and Big Discovery. Yeah. Everybody on the panel. Next pop-up we'll is Friday, folks. Next pop-up is Friday. And early, early morning. morning. Early, early morning. I also have my contest running till the 1st of January. Thanks, Biggie. You reminded me. Nice. You're so, welcome, bro. Real quick, though, when you're talking contest, Biggie, to enter your contest, how easy is it? Just real quick. How easy is it? Well, you can leave a comment or you can you, the the contest is you got to impersonate me. <laughs> so, if you do a video where you impersonate Biggie, I don't yeah. smoke. It, it's three it's three uh, entries. Right. Or right. you can or, edit or you you don't have to impersonate Biggie cuz couldn't you edit some of your content out and play with it cuz that's Yeah. yeah I wanted so, people I wanted people to look at my videos and edit one for me. And that will count as an entry, too, for, for three entries. Got it. And you got to be subscribed, and you got to be 18, right? Right. Okay. How do you enter your contest, Big Will? Well, obviously, subscribe and 18 or over for me, too. But it's really super easy. Either make a video or leave a comment telling me how you budget for comics, whether it's, in general, your weekly pulls, grails, just how do you do it. Comment gets you one entry. Video will get you three entries into a first, second, or third place prize. Nice. I have a specific video to link everything to, and it shows you every book that's the prize. Awesome. Well, with that, I'm going to close out this show by saying don't forget. 
We had a great had a time. time. <laughs> Thanks, everybody. Check you guys out later. <laughs>